Alrighty guys, so we're in our second month of 2021 and things just don't look any better than it was in 2020. People's New Year's resolutions are literally going out the window because there's no gyms, they feel like they've got no discipline and they simply just can't achieve their perfect body physique that they always dreamed of. Well, in this video, I'm gonna be showing you guys how I'm gonna be pretty much achieving my dream body as a natural bodybuilder the quickest way and the most effortless way because who really wants to put effort in to make themselves look really good because it's just hard work. Working out all the time, trying to eat healthy, trying to get that ripped body, you know, the six packs, just physically looking good and you just wanna be in that, you know, that, that one person that looks like in the men's health magazine, you know? You, you know, you, you feel me? You feel me kind of like aspire to that? You no, know, sure, damn, I do. Well. In this video, I'm gonna be showing you guys how I'm gonna do this, and this is how. I'm going on Fiverr, looking for multiple people to edit my body, ranging from cheap to more expensive, and I'm going to send them a picture of myself with hopes that they'll make me look more of a bodybuilder. Almost like the UK never had free lockdowns and the gyms were still open. And also something you aspire to in the men's health magazine. This is where this video comes in. I am putting five, five people to the test with their Photoshop skills, and there can only be one winner. So I'm gonna be putting to the test whether or not you really need to work out to get the ideal body, or you can just simply Photoshop it. Let's put it to the test. Let's find out. So let's have a quick look at the first one. It's got five star ratings. Looks like it's got like 43 reviews, or that's 43 people kind of like done a thumbs up, like, comment, subscribe. I will Photoshop your muscles bigger. Okay, let's have a look. Before, after, very, very marginal gains, but very realistic. I like it. I mean, you can't complain about the price either. Three pounds 79, wow. and you get one day delivery, which is fantastic for this YouTube video. One revision, so if you're a little bit unhappy, you can literally just tell them like, yo, that needs changing. I want bigger biceps. High quality commercial use. Banging. Sold. Let's buy. Hi. Lockdown's been tough to get myself into a bodybuilder physique. And I want an Instagram photo to pop off. Something you see in the Men's Health magazine that people would aspire to and get me plenty of girls. Every five eyes I'm using in this video, I'm going to be using the same description and the same image. I will enhance muscles and body tone in pictures using Adobe Photoshop. That is literally what I just need. 11 pound 37, a little bit more premium compared to the previous guy because the last guy was what, three pounds something plus tax on top, which was like five pounds, I think. Whoa. Now he, he, he's looking small. You don't want to mess with him, all right? It, it, it will have you, all right? It will have you. It will steal your pack lunch, all right, at school. I will enhance muscle size and body toning your photos using the Adobe Photoshop. This can make a great athletic image for social media and provide you with boosted motivation to achieve your fitness goals. I mean, that's what we want, right? We want something that's gonna boost me to aspire what I wanna look in the future. This is literally the guy, this is perfect. This is perfect. Now this one looks pretty good. Enhance your body, it order now. Literally, this one literally is perfect for the gym. If that is real, that is unbelievable. That one looks bloody interesting, that one. I will Photoshop you and add abs and muscles. Look at the difference of that. That is so realistic. He's gonna get all the girls, he is. Thing is, this is a free day delivery and I don't think I've got enough time for that, man. Fortunately, we will have to uh, scrap that, my friend. Look at that. He's got a bit of a belly, bit of titties. And look how big those abs are. Those, I'll tell you what, that ab right there is bigger than his goddamn bicep. It's, it's, it's even probably bigger than his bloody head. That is crazy. <laughs> you are hired, my friend, for work. You know what, just for the video, I think this is gonna be the last guy. So we are going to go with this guy here. Okay, so that's five eyes that we just hired to enhance our body to something that our body could potentially look like if the gyms were like still open or hopefully what our body could look like in the future as a bodybuilder or something out of Men's Health Magazine. So I'll see you guys in a couple of days or so. All right guys, so it's been two days now since I submitted the pictures. Got all the pictures all delivered in one day, which was very successful. I thought I might have like one or two who wouldn't deliver in time. What I'm gonna be doing now is gonna be reacting to them, so before and after. And once I've done that, we're gonna be ranking them best to worst. Hopefully we look like a bodybuilder or something out of Men's Health Magazine and they don't make me look bloody ridiculous. Without further ado, Let's react to them. So the first image we're gonna to react to was my first person I paid on Fiverr. You think he made it realistic and he thinks it made it pop as well. So let's have a quick look. So this is the before and this is the after. It looks all right. Like, it looks like notable gains. Maybe this could have looked like if the gyms were still open. My my waist somehow got smaller. Lost a bit of bone weight. The biceps are looking pretty good. The deltoids are looking good as well. The pecs looking rather big on the side by the bicep. This is something you probably would see in the Men's Health magazine. So for five pounds, you can't complain. It looks like my neck and my my jaw. Nah, 
He's made my head bigger. My head's big enough already. Are you kidding me? I paid for my body, not my bloody face, all right? Why do I need a chiseled bloody jaw? It's like sticking up like... Have you, have you seen that Squidward meme when he's got like, the massive jaw and he's absolutely hench? I literally just look like that. What, what the hell has he done there? But overall, five pounds, can't complain. Let's go on to the next one. So this one was done from Oliver and he replied super fast. Within four minutes since I made the purchase, he replied back to me and even delivered my order on the same day. So here's the before. And here's the after. And you can tell there's massive gains, like especially on my right arm. Like my right arm is humongous compared to my left arm. Like the, the left deltoid looking pretty good, the shoulders looking pretty good, but my left arm is not even developed. It's like an infant arm compared to like a, the Hulk arm on the right hand side. Like what is that? Like it looks like my right arm has literally just been used and abused on the P-Hub like all day, every single day for the last like 30 years. Basically, he just worked on the right arm and that's it. I don't think he's done anything to my face. So thank you so much for like not, not changing my face or you know my bone structure of my face. So I appreciate that, man. Thank you. All right, all right, all right. This next one's gonna blow your mind. So I've got to read this paragraph because it's gonna make you laugh, right? Compared to the image and the paragraph he literally sent me. All right, let's, let's get straight into it. I have completed the enhancement of your image. As requested, I have used a similar process to what is done for magazine editing. Increase overall height and shoulder width subtly. Increase definition to the abdominals and flatten the stomach. Enhance mass and vascularity. And remove minor skin imperfections. He's lethal! <laughs> Unreal, huh? Like, this is what you just see in the Men's Health magazine. Like, literally, he is super knowledgeable and he does the same techniques and what they do in a magazine. Look how ripped I am. I've never seen abs so ripped. And look at the obliques as well, like, and I'm not too sure about the chest. It's kind of like, one looks a bit small. It's almost like someone's just had like a dodgy breast implant in all fairness. Uh, I'm, I'm not too sure what's going on with my with my trap there though, um, on my right trap. Right trap is looking huge compared to my, my left, but I guess my phone's in the way. I guess it's quite hard for him to edit that one because my phone's kind of in the way in order for him to kind of get the trap there. 15 pounds. What do you guys think? Comment down below, out of five. <laughs> what the hell, how did he manage that? Like my head's even smaller. Like he's done me a favor, he, he, he's made my head smaller. So we had the first artist that made my head bigger and then the third artist has actually made my head smaller. <laughs> oh my God, what is going on? Like, why is everyone just keep like messing around with my face? What's, what's, what's wrong with it? Coming with the fourth image from the fourth artist and this is the before and this is the after. So Victor done a pretty good job on this. So it's a bit of a shame I look like something out of like a, I don't know, like an anime or or like an action figure doll or toy. Just looking very shiny compared to my face. Kind of look like drained out from the top and then I look very like flush. Would you see this in the Men's Health magazine? Probably looking pretty good. My pectorials look amazing. Like literally, I, I don't think any artist done a better job on my pectorials. This is amazing. And the abs are looking good, standing out. Not much done to the obliques. The biceps are looking a little bit bigger. My left arm is actually getting acknowledged. Didn't touch my face, thank you. And didn't touch my traps. Is 10 pounds well spent? I think so, I'm looking pretty good. Let's get on with the last one. Oh boy, oh boy, oh boy. Before and after. Like, what, what's happened to my pecs here? <laughs> I've got like a 60, 70 year old man pectorials right now. They're just sagging down. Literally, I've got old man titties, dude. Like, I've got old man titties. Like, why would you do that to me? And I've got someone else's abdominals. Like, what's wrong with my abdominals? You literally just got someone out of Baywatch and literally just pasted it onto my body. It's completely different. Like, the complexion is different. Ah, oh, I give up. I give up. Like, no. Five pounds is not well spent here. You gave me old man's titties and Baywatch abs. Like, ah. Oh. I appreciate that, but I already had like the top two abs. Like, give me more abs, man. And he's done nothing to the arms and shoulders, like nothing else. Tilly's and Baywatch abs. Cheers, mate. Right, guys, the time has come where we're gonna compare them all together, and I'm gonna rate them from worst to best. So starting off with the worst one, uh, I think you guys already know, man. I felt quite offended, man. You literally just gave me six-year-old titties and a Baywatch abs when like my, my abs were like kind of fine already. Like you just want to add more abs on. Ahmed. Take the fifth place, fourth place, we go with Devon. Yeah, the reason I put him in fourth place, like, look at you done to my body, right? I, I, uh, come on, man, looks like you just like, I just injected like a load of bloody steroids in like my right pec and literally just left everything else. It looks kind of wrong to me. Um, I definitely would not aspire to that. And also paying like 15 pounds for this, uh, nah. Um, I just can't justify 15 pounds for that work. It's just a little bit too much for my liking. Coming in, in 
Number three, we've gone with Oliver. Quite a hard one. Um, I would probably would have put this at fourth, but the reason why I didn't put this fourth is because it's cheaper than it was from Devon. I've neglected my bicep, and you just made my right bicep too huge. Coming in with the second place, and it's Victor. You know what? I was quite happy with this. Apart from like, if you just take away like I look like a like an action figure doll uh, or toy, it looks pretty good. Decent noticeable gains. My pet toys look amazing. This is like the best one in terms of like making my pec stand out and my abs are looking really good. I tell you now, like if he didn't make my body look so shiny and make my face look kind of like washed out, if he'd like maybe done something to my face, this would have easily, easily would have been first place. But here you go, your winner for this is Jonah. And this is why this guy came first place, it's just because he just put everything in proportion, like, you know, my biceps are looking good, deltoids are looking really good as well. Hasn't touched my traps, which is fine, because I've got quite big traps anyway. Some of the eyes like made my traps look bigger, like, like it didn't need to be bigger. It's hard, man, because I wish Victor, man, I wish Victor was in first place, but he just made my body too shiny because that looked incredible. I, I honestly really rate the second place, but I had to give it to had to give it to Jonah, man, just because it just looks more realistic. And there you have it, guys. That is me paying five other people to edit my body like a bodybuilder or something you see at a men's health magazine. Please comment down below which one is your favorite and why. If you guys enjoyed this video, be sure to drop a like button and subscribe to the channel if you haven't already with that post notification bell on also so you don't miss a video from me. If you guys want to see something like this again on the channel, please comment down below. Um, if you guys know how to use Photoshop, let me know as well because I wouldn't mind seeing what you guys can do to my body in order to make me look more like a bodybuilder or something out of Men's Health magazine. I'll see you guys for another video from me. Peace out.